What does the word scope mean? Tell me now. Ice, ice scope. What does that mean? Ice. Just scope. No, scope, 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 scope. Come on. What does scope mean? You. What does scope mean? A scope means something is scope. something you. I didn't say. Oh, What's matter with you? I didn't say scoop. I said scope. Oh, scope to see. Ah, okay. ah, I like that word. Say it again. A what? Range. One more time. Range. One more time. Say the confidence. Range. Good. Range. A range of things. Now, listen to me. Let me explain what this scope equals SP file means. Mm. What is this? Content, area. Content. Okay, 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 thank you. Range. Okay, we get it. Thank you very much, Mr. Tyler. Thank you. That's a Forget that. Let me explain to you guys what does scope mean, really. Why, why, he, Mr. Solomon asked a valid question. Why is it that we have to what? Bounce the database. Why is it that we all have to do this? Let me explain to you guys why. Because they could ask you this on an interview. Watch this. Watch this. What is the file that is needed to start up the database? Ah? Uh, SP file. SP file. file, right? SP file, right? Okay. But the key word is this. In order for your database to successfully start, it must successfully read all the parameters inside of the what? SP file. Say control file. Inside of what? Mr. SP file. SP file. What does this have to call control file? With the what? SP file, right? Mr. <laughs> right? Right, Mr. Right. So now watch this. Every time, let's say your computer is shut down, right? <laughs> let's say, listen to me, this guy is funny. What is? <laughs> let's say that your server was shut down, right? And then you started back up and tell it. <laughs> you guys are like Bernie and and and, and, Jerry. Bernie and, and Tom and Jerry or Bernie and. Only and Julius. Yeah. <laughs> Right? So who's Julius? Yeah, I don't know who. Tell me, I can't look for. No, that's a bad example. <laughs> 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 I'm not gay. Oh no, no, no. Nobody's saying gay. Man, so no, 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 no. I'm not gay. And there's nothing. There's nothing wrong. Oh no, there we go. Are you gay? All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, watch. All right, pay attention. Pay attention. Pay attention. So when your server, let's have a listen. This is a, what, what do you have next to your feet? You have your database server, correct? All right, so when you turn your database server on, let's say it was off, and then you turn it back on, right? Does everybody understand? Linux, or Oracle, whatever you want to call it, right? Reads all the param, all the files that are on the operating system, right? Okay, first of all, wait, watch this. Then you do startup. Right? What Oracle is going to do is this. It's going to do, it's going to read all the parameters inside the physical SP file. Right? It's going to read it first into its memory. Right? And if there are no errors, then it's okay, no problem. I successfully started, then it will take you to the next point, which is what? Mount. Does everybody understand? Yeah. Right? So it reads the physical SP file first, right? And then it does what? It takes all, it remembers all those settings, all those parameters, and places it where? Inside its memory. Does everybody understand? Right? Inside the memory, right? Mm -hmm. Now what is? When I try to change a parameter that is not dynamic in nature, but that it's static, and I do what? Scope equals SP file. What happens is this. If it were a dynamic parameter, the reason why it is dynamic is because what? It can be changed what? On the fly. Now, what does it mean to be to change something on the fly? It simply means this. I can change it both physically on the SP file and in the memory of Oracle. Does everybody understand? Mm -hmm. So I can change it everywhere. Scope equals both. But SP file and memory. Does everybody understand? Yeah. Alright, now what this? What this now? When I do scope equals SP file, this is what's gonna happen. Alter system sets, whatever it is, scope equals SP file. Semicolon enter. 
What Oracle has now done is this. It says what? System altered, right? So what Oracle has now done is this. It has, in fact, changed it physically for the SP file. It has changed it physically. But because this is a static file, it cannot change it in its memory until you have bounced the database. So, you have changed it physically. That's why you said what? Score? Score. The range of this change. The range. The range of the change. Scope equals SP file. It's SP file. Not SP file and memory. Do you understand know what I'm saying? It has to change. For you to see that it is changed, it needs to have changed in two places. Where? Physically in SP file and what? The memory. Does everybody understand? So when I do scope equals SP file, it has changed the physically. You see system altered. Then the next thing that we have to do is do what? We have to shut it down. Right? Because what's what this? Just because I have changed it physically does not mean that Oracle now knows that that change has taken place. Why? Because what Oracle remembers it to be still exists. Until I shut down the database and then do what? Start it back up. Then Oracle will have to do what? Reread the SP file. Oracle will have to what? Reread the SP file and say, oh, this has been changed. Now, let me put that setting in my memory and then you see it has changed. 